Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Lunar 2! Let's go get that white dragon aura from Leo, then. Get out of here. Don't have to fight any enemies on the way back down, too. That would be nice. I'm gonna have to alter my setup a little bit for this, but we'll be fine. If we can ever get to the bottom, that is. There we go. Okay, so, for Hero, let's see. I want... Where is it? Ah, the Wind Ring. Yeah. Wanna give that to you? There you go. Don't need the Shiro Crest there. But I do want the Warrior Crest. So let's give that to you and... Hmm. I, I guess the Healing Crest, whatever. There's nothing else that I would really want anyway. So, okay, there we go. And we are all at full. We're all set and ready to go. Nice of them to take that barricade out for us. Thanks a lot and all. You know, when they were capturing the kids and all that, could have, like, breathed fire on them or something. I mean, I know Galleon took away your powers and stuff, but apparently I went out the wrong exit. Okay, let's try this one again. Oh, nice of Leo to just uh, park that thing right next to us. Thanks a lot. How's it going? Hero, you must fight me. Why? The Chosen. Their way is not right. I know it in my heart. So just give it to us, then. However, I do not know how to escape from the web in which I become ensnared. Join us! And my options now are severely limited. I know good must prevail. Prove it now with your sword. I think you're the one who needs a spanking, Leo. For boss time! Okay, so when you see Leo swinging his sword around like that, that means he's going to use Flash Blade on us. So we want to defend against that in the one-on-one -on -one duel. For you, infidel. Let's see, what's he doing? Okay, when he's standing like that, that means he's going to use... One of his Earth Elemental spells, Sanya. But since I have the Wind Ring, that'll protect against that damage. Or at least it'll greatly reduce it. Kneel and perish. Whoa. I like how they use this music, though, for the one-on-one -on -one battles. Nice touch. Hopefully he won't heal himself. Dodge this. Actually, hopefully he will, so I can show you the quote that he says for that. Kneel and perish. Ow. Well, that wasn't so bad. Okay, now when you see him holding his sword like that, he's probably going to use an item to heal himself. And probably undo Not most of my this. work. But we'll see. Sample my goods. Nuts. Why do you even say that? You're not a merchant. Just kind of came out of nowhere there, Leo. So, yeah, you got to watch out for that when he, uh... Dodge this. When he's holding his sword out like that, that means he wants to heal himself, so... Oh, well. Kneel and perish. Wow, he's using all of his, uh, Earth's elemental spells. When I was practicing this earlier, the, uh... Yeah, he was always using the same one over and over again, but I guess he needs any of them. For you, infidel. But I do like how they keep most of his quotes here. Would have been nice if we could have kept Mystere, but oh well. Dodge this. Well, it'd be kind of hard when you're trying to create an earthquake. Kneel and perish. At least I didn't do some, like, mind control gag or something with him. I mean, he really needs to fight. So that way, well, I don't know. They, I guess, what are they going to do? Kill him or something? Put up a real fight and everything. Um, you know, we've almost got him. I think I can handle that defending this time. Dodge this! Did I get him? Hey, hey! 
Hey, all right. So yeah, basically just defend against the Flash Blade and go all out. And oh, a new spell. Not that I ever used that one, but I suppose it's there. If only there were an item that would let me increase my speed when I equip it. If only. Hey, hey all right. Well, yeah, I've been hanging around Lucia a lot, so. Sorry, uh, we don't have more room for more party members. It's either Lucia or Leo, and, well, gotta take the booty. There's no choice there. Oh, nice. Where's that? Oh, okay. Well, how are we gonna get over there? Oh, hey, hey, all right, got a new vehicle, the Destiny itself. Well, thank you. Who's running the engine room? You got, like, all your soldiers down here, or what? We're not worthy. We're not worthy. Oh, wow. You are unworthy. Where are you going to go, then? Just go back home or something? Or pack up your bags? That's it? Well, we don't really need two heroes with us, so... Okay. He is. But, alright. Well, not really more party members, but... More vehicles. Alright. Sounds like a plan. Let's go. Careful, it's gonna be a bumpy ride! Okay, let's see. So we got the White Dragon Aura. Now we can actually uh, go to the White Dragon Cave. But before we do that, let's heal up here. Twice, just to be sure. And let's see. Okay, so we want the healing ring on um, Hero there. And let's see, where is the other one? Ah, the Vigor Ring, because we're gonna be dealing with quite a bit of paralysis in the White Dragon Cave. Uh, let's see. So I want to go... Where's all my other crests? Okay, there we go. I want to go with the Power Crest. I think I gave the other one to Lamina. Oh, no, I didn't. I must have, uh, moved that then. Uh, where is the other one then? Ah, there it is. Dream Crest. So I can put some enemies to sleep. I don't like using, like, the Power Thunder Crest combo or Power Earth... Well, Earth Crest combo. Unless the enemies are weak to it, which in this case, they're not going to be. So, I, th I like putting enemies to sleep more with that. Okay, so let's see. We got all this stuff for Ronfar. And let's see, we want the Phoenix Ring to help protect against some ice elemental stuff. Water, ice, same difference. And let's see. Where did I put the Gauss's next? There you are. Yeah, I want to give that to you to protect it against paralysis as well. Go with Warrior Steel Crest combo. Jean, I'm not going to give any crests because anything that's left doesn't really do much. I mean, the Healing Crest might restore one or two HP <laughs> periodically, but it's just so worthless. So instead, I'm going to give her the Healing Ring. And let's see, give her the Luck Ring so that way she can get more crits. Lamina, I'll pretty much just leave as is. Might as well give Earth and Thunder Crest to her even though... Not really a whole lot we can do with that. Would be nice if I could use the Shiro Crest, but the only person who could use that maybe is, uh, Hero there. And I don't want to give Crest to Jean, so. Oh well. But yeah, uh, Lucia. Okay, now that we got you back, let's see what we're going to do. Let's, actually, let's put Hero at the bottom. Oh. No, no. Guys? There we go. Okay. Okay, Hero, you stay at the bottom. You stay up top. Oop. And... Lucia, there you go. I still want to keep Lucia up front for now, because some of the enemies there can poison us, too. And, well, she's immune to that, so that'll really help us out. And I'm good. I've decided I'm going to keep using the uh, cute ribbons for the ladies there. 
Magic defense will help him out. Alright, sounds like... Oh! Sounds like a plan. Let's go! As soon as I get back onto the ship, after getting off of it for some reason. Nice to have a portable healing point, though. Yes, I know. I, I heard you the first time. Okay, let's get out of here. Sure, how hard could that possibly be? Well, yeah, that too. Oh, yeah. Right, Lucia? <laughs> well, it looks like your adventures are far from over, Lucia. But yeah, we can just go right through the woods there, so we don't have to worry about... Uh, going through Taven's Peak to get going, so... Alright. Right. Well, that too. Oh, well. Anyway, well, we've got ice. Land ho! Okay, so, can't go any further than that, but this is good enough. So you press the square button, you can get back onto the Destiny here and get off. doesn't look like the where it was in the last game oh well I wonder if the cave has changed at all over the years it's been long enough okay just in case let's uh, save up oh you know there is one thing I might want to do uh, change the uh, staff I got on the Mina let's go with the flame staff for now but uh, make sure you got the Thieves Staff on standby, because there's going to be some items we want to steal here, too. Some of them are really good, too. I will let you know when we find the enemies. Or if I do. Who's there? Oh, hey, no. What's going on? Why do we have to go through this cave anyway? I mean, couldn't we just go back to Nal? Now, Nal's advice here... He is lying. There's nothing to do with four chests here or anything like that. I've heard it's like a holdover from the Sega CD version where there is some puzzle we had to solve or whatever with that. But then when they made the PlayStation version, they I guess they forgot about it or something. So, yeah, just ignore that line. Whoa, okay. Well, you could have given it to us before, but... I don't know why we gotta be here. But yeah, I think this place is almost identical to the way it was in the first game. Just that the enemies are, obviously, a lot harder. Okay, so, well, we got a lot of new enemies here. Okay, so the Yetis up front, those guys are pretty easy. They're weak to just about everything. Statuses, fire, you name it. We've got the Shiro Mongrel there. Oh, well, with the Yetis, by the way, I forgot. Um, when you see him standing up like that, he's just gonna attack normally. When you see them kind of hunched over like that, they're going to throw a snowball at you, and it will really hurt. Now, with the Shiro Mongrel, when you see its tail waving like that, that means that um, it's going to attack one character, just normally. But if you see whatever those purple things are, if you see them moving, or waving, or showing up, or whatever, uh, it means they're going to try and paralyze one of your characters. Uh, let's see. Shiro Mongrels are weak to fire, but they resist statuses. Or most of them, anyway. And then we got the uh, Mech Star. They're weak to fire. If you see it just kind of hovering there, it's just going to attack normally. But if you see like a little sparkle orbiting around it, it's going to attack you from range. So, let's see. They are weak to fire as well. So, okay. Let's see. Hero... How do I want to do this? Let's see, with the Yeti there. There we go. Okay, yeah, let's just attack normally for now. Let's see, we can attack the Shiro Mongol. Those guys are really fast. Even Gene might not be able to do a whole lot, but, well, I'll do the best I can. Okay, now what I want to do is get the Thieves Staff going. So let's equip that. And I want to try and steal from the Shiro Mongol, because they have an item that I'd want to get. Ow! Put it. Gypsy magic! 
Oh well, only two of them, but hey, they're weak to it, so that makes life a lot easier. Nuts. I wanted to steal from them! I'll take care of this. Well, anyway, the item that I wanted to steal from them is another Shiro Crest. Because, well, they're Shiro Mongrels, so of course they would have it. I'd like to steal a few of them if I can. Hey. I'm probably going to get a whole bunch just to have extras or spares in case I need it. But really, I think you could get away with one to three of them. That should be fine. Oh, right. I was going to use Anger Dice, but no. Can't do that. Oh, well. And just in case everyone completely whiffs at the guy, we'll go with another uh, flame stat there. Wow, that sucked. And he's immune to sleep, so oh well. Okay, I guess everyone did completely whiff at him. Oh well. Go, Lamina! Well, maybe I'll show another battle with the Shiro Mongrels and stealing from them or whatever. I didn't expect, uh... I think I must have, like, targeted the wrong guy or something, but oh well. Okay, well, we got a couple more Shiro Mongrels here. Let's try this one again, shall we? You go there. You go there. Let's get the thieves staff going again. There we are. I uh, should have targeted the one in the middle there. Oh well. Uh, looks like Dream Dance isn't going to help us too much. Oh well. They're not immune to it, so I guess. Please don't kill both of them. Please. Thank you. Please don't kill the Shiro Mongrel, Lucia. Thank you. Come on, get it, damn it. Ah, oh, man. Oh, well. Oh, now she's gonna kill them all. Now you use the ability that I want. Oh, well. Yeah, let's go back to Thieves Staff. Or, Flame Staff. Whoops. From the Thieves Staff. Whatever. Too bad we can't get a Flame Crest or something to go like Power Flame Crest combo, but oh well. Okay, well, I'm not going to do that again. If I get it off screen, well, I get it off screen then. Whatever. Ah, but it looks like we got a new, a new enemy in the back there. Mutant Fly. When you see it spinning around like that, that means it's going to poison you. If it's just kind of flapping its wings, hovering in place, it's just going to attack you normally. Oh yeah, and you can see how they're, uh, whatever those things are. I don't know what those purple things are. But yeah, that means they're going to try and paralyze you. Fortunately, all my front, well, most of my frontline characters are immune to that. So, let's see. I want to go after the mutant fly if I can. Can I... No, I probably can't get a status element to go through. That's okay. Um, where is it? There you go. Let's try this one again, Lamina. Or you could just sit on your ass and do nothing. Why do you do this to me, game? Ha ha. I was going to say, maybe I could have Ronfar uh, remove the uh, light, or the paralysis. But he can't cast any spells right now. Oh, well. Okay, um, let's see. I really want to steal that thing. So, you know what? Let's use, where is it? Ah, cleansing water. If you don't have that, you could also use holy water. That pretty much cures just about everything anyway. Ha uh -huh. ha. Well, good to see your spirits are still up. Man, Lucia is pretty mad now. 
they didn't even touch her. Okay, well anyway, let's see. Yeah, let's just defend until I can steal the item that I want. Come on, Lamina. I'll take care of this. Thank you. Sometimes they just won't have, well, they actually usually, they won't have an item that I want. But, okay, they didn't. Ah, oh, nuts. Please don't kill the bottom one. Okay, we're good, we're good. I was gonna have Ronfire maybe kill the bottom one, but this works too. Man, Lucia's getting kind of bloodthirsty now. I'll take care of this. Did she just try to steal twice from that guy? Huh, that's weird. Okay, well, they don't have... Just take my word for it, viewers. You can steal Shiro crests from them. But there is another item that I want to steal from some enemies around here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the rest of this floor, clear out all the enemies here, and if I meet up with the last new enemy, there's actually five new enemies in this area, and if I can meet up with them, I'll show it. If not, well, I'll save it for later. So I'll just take care of all that and be right back. Hey, hey, all right. Well, there you go, viewers. You can indeed get a Shiro Crest from these guys. Well, that's at least one item that I wanted to steal. It's not all of them, but, well, it's a good start. Actually, yeah, why don't you go after the guy who's still awake? You know, let's try and steal from the other guy if I don't kill all these guys immediately. Or you could just wake them up. Okay, that works too. Okay, back to finding the last enemy if I can. Okay, we're back. Cleared out all the enemies here. Couldn't find the last new enemy that I was looking for, but oh well, we'll meet up with them later. Uh, that, that is the Chiro Mongro. Not Shiro, Chiro. They're almost identical, but you can steal Chiro crests from them, and they are really, really, really good. I would like to at least be able to steal one of them if I can. Snake ring? What does that do? I have no idea. I never use it. Ah. Oh, okay. I don't know how much that really helps, but, well, I never use it, but... Well, oh well. That's, that's nothing to worry about. By the way, you might have seen some icicles or stalactites or stalagmites. Uh, blocking the path there, if you can trick an enemy into running into them, you can actually break them down that way. You can't break it down yourself. So, just like the first game, you could have done that. But we have the white dragon wings to get out of here, so we really don't need to worry about that. So what I'm going to do is, on the next floor, they actually have a whole bunch of those mongrels running around, and it's probably the best place to find the Chiro mongrels that I want. So I'm going to try to do that and uh, try to get the item that I want out of them. But can we get the power of the white dragon back? Find out next time on Let's Play Lunar 2. This is H.E. Bailey signing off. Have a good day.